Welcome back to the channel. Oh, it's good to be back out. Brought the lunch on too with me this time. Thought I'd bring it out for a little spin. Blow the dust off it. <laughs> what an evening for it. It's been absolutely beautiful today. So, uh, yeah, as with most camps, the hardest part was getting out the door. But I pushed myself through it. <laughs> I'm gonna get the tea on the go here now and just chill out. To get the jacket on, the old evenings are getting chilly now. Roll on those frosty nights. <laughs> Fresh frosty mornings, I can't wait. Brought some digestive biscuits out with me today. If there's anything that could compete with rich tea, it has to be the good old digestive. <laughs> I do like my biscuits now, I have to say. I was very close to not coming out to me. So, so close. I had myself tormented. Uh, the old anxiety cropped up. But I'm delighted I pushed myself out. You know, got myself through the door. Because it would have been so easy just to stay at home. I've mentioned this before on the channel, but it does kind of haunt me a bit, you know. And uh, I really struggled. Like, even when I pulled up in the car, I thought, what's the point in getting out, like, you know. Just was not in the mood for it. And then I would hike down the trail a bit. And the further along I went, the more at ease I became. And the more I looked forward to just getting my tent set up and chilling out, you know. I can see why people find it hard to start out camping. The biggest part of it is getting out the front door. And uh, just giving yourself that push, you know. So, I've been camping now for... Two and a half, nearly three years. Still a struggle sometimes. But it's always worth it. <laughs> I've only got one little complaint about this lantern so far. I'm only after turning it on. And, you know, I'm sitting back, chilling out. And all I want now is a nice cup of tea. <laughs> Something that I've noticed with is that even though it's just been on, this part of the lantern doesn't get hot. The glass is a bit warm to touch, but the red part there, the base of the lantern is it's grand, you know, so happy days, that's a good little feature to have because I wouldn't want to be scalding myself. Oh lads, things you do for camping, huh? As I was walking into this spot, I saw a beautiful, beautiful stag, I think it was a fallow deer, it was absolutely stunning, I only saw him. I didn't see any other deer with him and uh, I was very very close to him, I think I snuck up on him by accident but um, I'm just happy I got to see him, I didn't get him on camera but I just kind of, when I know I'm not going to get them in time I just watched them and uh, you know, I have it up here <laughs> it's no good to you but 
Oh, he was stunning. Full antlers. <laughs> my pouch is falling apart here. I'm just gonna put my dehydrated meal on because uh, yeah, I don't want to be starving Marvin in the middle of the night, you know. So I've got ready to go, get me tea on. I think I'm gonna have to make smaller batches of meals because I've been eating the same meal pretty much every time I've been out. <laughs> uh, I need a bit of variety in my life, you know. Tea bag would be handy, wouldn't it? Just rolling up the leg of my trousers just to keep the dirt off my sleeping bag. I have the whole lot set up now. I have the Thermos X Term, the Natrike sleeping bag, and the Trekology pillow. Usual kind of setup that I have. Temperatures aren't meant to drop too low tonight, so I should be alright. Um, I spent the best part of an hour, maybe an hour and a half, sitting outside just looking at the stars, looking at the moon. Listening to distant fox screaming, so yeah, it was nice. Nice just chilling out, had me a cup of tea, and I had my dehydrated meal, so that was grand, you know. Same old story with those. <laughs> It's a beautiful morning here this morning. Just a pity I didn't see more of it. <laughs> I had a fairly bad night's sleep. Felt like I was awake most of the night. And then the alarm went off at six o'clock and from six until eight, I slept solidly. So I actually slept it out this morning. <laughs> but I have a fair bit of stuff I need to get done today. Um, so I got myself all wrapped up. Left no trace, usual crack. I'm delighted that I pushed myself out through that door last night because I just love being out, you know, and anxiety can really take over and make you feel like you're not in the mood for it or you don't want to go or loads and loads of different things. So hopefully you enjoyed this little video and uh, hopefully you'll stick around and join me for the next one and I'll see you then. Good luck.